challenge. A. Listen to a podcast about Bethany Hamilton. Complete the sentences with the correct information. Choose A, B, or C. Bethany Hamilton was born in Hawaii in 1990. As a child, Bethany was very athletic. She loved skateboarding and swimming, but her greatest passion was surfing. Her parents were avid surfers too, so Bethany began surfing before the age of five. Almost every day, Bethany and her best friend Alana spent time surfing together. Then, at age eight, Bethany entered and won her first real surf competition. After that, she dreamed of becoming a professional surfer. However, in October of 2003, when Bethany was 13, she was attacked by a 14-foot tiger shark while she was surfing with her friend Alana and Alana's father. Alana and her father put Bethany on a surfboard and paddled her to shore. Miraculously, Bethany survived. She needed several surgeries, but sadly, she lost her left arm. In spite of her severe injury, and less than one month after the shark attack, Bethany decided to return to surfing. At first, it was extremely frustrating. Although Bethany tried to paddle her surfboard, she couldn't do it fast enough to catch the waves, and she kept falling off. Her mother began to think surfing was a bad idea for Bethany. It was tough, but Bethany never considered giving up. Her father made a handle for the surfboard, and finally Bethany was able to stay on her board. She also learned to kick harder, which helped make up for the loss of one paddling arm. Bethany's aim was to enter the World Junior Championships, but first, she needed competition experience. In her first local competition, only three months after she lost her arm, Bethany took fifth place. A year later, she won first place in a national surfing championship. And in 2007, Bethany finally achieved her dream and turned pro, participating in numerous world events as a professional surfer. Bethany has taken part in many surfing competitions since then, including a World Junior Championship, where she earned a second-place title. Bethany's amazing story is one that motivates people, young and old alike. In 2004, she wrote her autobiography, and a few years later, her book was made into a movie. She has traveled worldwide, encouraging people to overcome the obstacles they face and pursue their dreams. Bethany has also started a charity to help other shark attack survivors and people who have lost arms and legs. She is an accomplished athlete, a determined individual, and above all else, an inspiring and courageous role model.